Believe it or not, UFOs have been spotted over O'Hare. Chicago Tribune transportation writer John Hilkovich joining us from the Tribune Tower with more on this exclusive story now. And John, um, these are credible professionals that saw what they saw back in November, correct? Yeah, they sure are, uh, Jim. Uh, about a dozen of them, from uh, ramp workers, maintenance, maintenance workers, even pilots, on November 7th saw this disc-shaped object uh, floating above the uh, sea concourse of United Airlines at O'Hare. Uh, very low in the sky. It was still daylight, very distinct. Uh, didn't uh, look like an airplane, a helicopter, or anything else uh, they've, they've seen. And uh, they have reported this both to their airline and to the FAA. And these career professionals are telling you, John, that they're, they're, they in no way would they ever play games that could affect the lives of the, some hundreds of thousands of people that, that fly through O'Hare. This is really, they're, they're, they're very determined and, and, and convinced they saw what they saw. Oh, well, they're, they're completely serious about this, and they want to get to the bottom of it. And they're concerned that whatever it was, even if it was some kind of military craft or some, something else, uh, that it be identified because it could pose a safety hazard. Uh, they went on the record with their airline and the FAA giving their names, mm -hmm. and uh, certainly they were not hoaxing anybody. Uh, they just want to get an explanation, if at all possible. So what did the FAA say? Well, the FAA uh, at first denied it when I called them, saying, we don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I put in a Freedom of Information request, and then when the FAA went through communications tapes, uh, they called me back and said, well, yes, actually, there was quite a bit of radio talk, and a United Airlines supervisor did call the O'Hare Tower and inquire if controllers had seen anything uh, out of the ordinary up there. So the FAA is acknowledging that United Airlines did contact them about this, mm -hmm. although officially United says uh, they've checked their logs and talked to their people, and uh, they, they don't know anything about mm -hmm. this. Incredible. Nice work, John, once again, in, in the articles in today's trip. Thank you.